What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. I'm playing a little bit of Mortal Kombat, the arcade collection, which uh, Mortal Kombat means a lot to me. I, I know a lot of you younger players have never played these older versions of Mortal Kombat, but trust me, in the 90s, these games were as big as Call of Duty, if not bigger. People around the world talked about them, and uh, they still have a lot of staying power for me. We got the uh, Beastly Thoughts tournament coming up, so I figured, why not play a little bit of this uh, and... and Maybe, you know, uh, exercise my Mortal Kombat fingers a little bit because, hey, who knows, I might end up playing this for uh, for my Beastly Thoughts tournament, Not Too Nerdy Entertainment. Uh, but yeah, I, I love Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat 3 was probably my strong suit. I think Mortal Kombat 2 was overall a better game, but Mortal Kombat 3 was probably the one that I uh, played the most of and probably honed my skills in the most. I can play with pretty much everybody in the game, and I'm pretty decent at it. And, uh, you know, I figured I'd play it and talk to you guys a little bit about some stuff I just heard uh, through the grapevine. I heard that GameStop, the uh, used video game retail store, is um, basically accepting used connects. Yeah, used connect 2.0s. Uh, you know, the Xbox One's Connect 2.0. You can sell it right now. You can get $32 in-store cash or $40 in-store credit. <laughs> this guy is tripping. Um, which, hmm, I'm, I'm trying to see who would actually do that at this time. Probably a lot of people out there. There's a lot of guys and gals who bought the Xbox uh, One who didn't want to connect initially. And, um, oh, I, sh I, I should have hit him. Uh... Sometimes your mind gets flustered when you're playing Mortal Kombat. It happens to the best of us, guys. Um, yeah, but there's probably a lot of people out there who... who uh, I had to get that out quick. Who would trade it in for a game. There's probably a game out there that the Xbox One owners have probably wanted, and a lot of you guys haven't had the opportunity or the funds to buy it. You can take your Connect, the thing that you probably don't use that much, right into GameStop now and trade it in. And, uh, you know, you, then you have the, the game that you want it, then you got the new update coming, which will free up all that GPU power, processing power of the uh, Xbox One. And then you'll have 1080p games, 60 frames per second, or at least that's what's being said. So you guys let me know what you think about that. Yeah, um, well, GameStop did say that, um, I'm going to switch characters on the, I thought the game was over. GameStop said that the uh, $400 Xbox One was selling like hotcakes, that it's been flying off the shelf. I mean, I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people who, uh, wanted a four hundred dollar xbox one and then on top of that they wanted one without a connect so it's like a win-win for everybody and uh... i can i can believe that that they've been selling like hotcakes oh this this guy's pissing me off and i accidentally punched him let's, let's uh... try somebody else yeah um... they're going to be selling the the connect at gamestop and microsoft is going to be selling the connect 2.0 as well at an unspecified price. Now, I talked to the guys on the Beastly Thoughts show about this. I'm thinking that the price will be no less than 120. There has to be an incentive for people to buy the Xbox One with the Connect for 499. If you can spend $400 right now on the Xbox One and uh, then buy a Connect for $100, there's no incentive for you to buy the whole thing together. So they're going to up the price of the Connect. I would guess to about 119.99. And if GameStop is going to be purchasing them for 40 bucks they'll probably sell them for 79 69 dollars something like that and which could be good for consumers oh oh um <laughs> i love nightwolf yeah so we'll see what happens in the future with that um you guys leave a comment in the comment section let me know if you're going to uh take advantage of this gamestop deal where you can trade in your uh trade in your xbox one's connect 2.0 which has been the bane of the Xbox One for quite a while. Oops, I shouldn't have done that. I get so caught up in my combos, guys. It's like, <sighs> takes me back to the 90s. Sep what was it, September September 9th? I'm trying to, it was Mortal Monday when Mortal Kombat first came out. Who doesn't remember that? Uh oh, 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 oh. You tripping, son. Don't you know who I be? I be the beastly gamer, baby. Yeah, but back to Mortal Kombat. Man, I love this game. Who doesn't love it? It's, uh, it's, 
just a heck of an experience. I like the new Mortal Kombat too, but I'm you you get to a certain age, and especially like people now playing the new Mortal Kombat and Mortal Kombat X, the people who are playing that now, you guys will um, think that that's the definitive version because that's the one you grew up with. One day there'll be a Mortal Kombat 20, and it'll be better than the Mortal Kombat you guys are playing now in every way. But you will always go back to the one you honed your skills on, and the one that you played with your buddies that, that has nostalgia for you that you can still get with your people and play with on and that's for me Mortal Kombat 2, Mortal Kombat 3 even Mortal Kombat 1 which I wasn't really into Mortal Kombat 1 as much as Mortal Kombat 2 but um, I'm gonna play one more let's see um, I wish I could hear you guys pick pick who should I pick who should I be these peoples alright we'll just go we'll roll with Kung Lao Kung Lao which is always second best to Liu Kang and you didn't know that now you know cousin here we go. Um, oh, 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 my face. Oh, 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 oh. You got some good sweep. You got some good blocks there, son. Come on. Be oh, he <laughs> didn't fall for it. Ah, uh, well, Kung Lao, he's still the man. Kung Lao's still the man. I like his style. I like his shit more than Liu Kang's. Because he wants to be the man. And Liu Kang just wouldn't let him shine. You know, he got that fancy ass hat. Who wouldn't let a man shine with a hat like that? Oh! What's it gonna be? Ah! Whoosh! Whoosh! Oh! <laughs> hey, you guys leave a comment in the comment section below. What's your favorite Mortal Kombat? As far as the old school goes. And, uh, let me know. I'm the BC Gamer. And I love Mortal Kombat. I'll see you guys next time.